So, John, a 2 1 defeat um, ends our run of uh, unbeaten streak. Uh, what went wrong out there today? Yeah, disappointed, obviously, that we, we lost again, but it wasn't with, um, anything to do with uh, attitude or uh, application. The boys worked their socks off. We just didn't really have the quality in possession to really hurt them today, I thought. They're probably one of the best teams we've played, actually. They, uh, they passed the ball well, they moved it well, they moved, moved us around the pitch. Uh, but the first half, you know, we were really well organised, really disciplined. And there wasn't many clear-cut chances and obviously we got the goal to make it 1-0. And we just said to the players at the second half, is, you know, if we keep being organised um, like we have been in the first half, and um, you know, we're a little bit better with the, the ball at our feet, you know, better in possession, switching play quicker, and uh, being brave on the ball to take the ball. And then, you know, as long as we don't concede, we'll go on and win the game. But um, we didn't really do that in possession. We kept giving the ball away sloppily and um, we didn't look like a real threat on the counter attack like we usually do. Um, and then they started to grind, grind us down a little bit, you know, with their play. Obviously losing Kulo at the time, we lost Kulo was a big blow as well. And um, we just couldn't really get to get to grips with um, you know our attacking threat really. And um, even though we had a few chances on, on the break, we didn't create too many chances. So uh, disappointed with that aspect, but I think um, you know uh, all runs come to an end. I just said to the players in there, you know, last year when we had that really good run, um, and it came to an end at Nantwich and um, the boys went straight back on another winning streak so now it's um, you know it's done and dusted it's all over with uh, now we concentrate on Tuesday night against Curzon and hopefully we can put a good performance in and get another three points mm -hmm. and um, talking about uh, the injuries Coulson uh, Bailey and Will both under some uh, robust challenges as well yeah. uh, how are they all doing in there? Yeah Bill's all right I think he probably could have been a setting off to be honest he's, he's gone off with um, both feet and uh, caught Bales quite high up um, and, the referee gave me a yellow card for me, it was a red card. Uh, the referee probably didn't have the best game today, he was giving them a lot of decisions most of the game. Um, didn't hardly give us any um, decisions, but I'm not taking anything from that really. It's just we weren't good enough, you know, uh, in our overall uh, possession game and, you know, we're going forward and we weren't really an attacking threat like we normally are. Uh, defensively, the work rate from all the boys is always, is always there, you know. Um, you know, any fan who came today, you know, could see that the players were absolutely working the socks off um, for each other, and it just sometimes it's not your day. Um, I thought the fans were absolutely brilliant today. We've we travelled down to watch us, supported the lads all the way to the end, even when we just nearly scored towards the end of the game, uh, but it wasn't to be. Mm -hmm. And uh, we turn our attention to Curzon, a double header um, with them in the FA Cup as well. Is that going to be tactically a bit different? Obviously, seeing you've got two games in such short space time. Yeah, them. like you know, I always say to you, I always take one game at a time. I always concentrate on the, uh, the next game. Obviously, Curzon, Curzon in the league on Tuesday was really important. Like I said, to try and get back to winning, winning ways. Um, I'll, I'll watch their game from today and tomorrow, and have a look at how they set up now. Uh, have a look at you know uh, their best players and you know weak points of the game, and then we'll try and get a plan to go to Tuesday and, and win that game first. Uh, and look, we're not really too fussed about the Saturday game again in the FA Cup just yet. Um, I think it's just important that we pick the boys back up, get them um, back bouncing and back um, smiling because there's a few sad faces in there, but they shouldn't be sad because they've been absolutely terrific for us. Um, all of last year and all of this year so far, you know, we've, we've lost a game of football, that, that, that's, that happens. Um, now we've got a bounce back and um, I'm sure that we'll 